In this video, we're going to tie the improved clinch on. In this case, we're using braided line, so we're actually going to make some adjustments to the typical improved clinch knot and uh, so let's get started and we'll, I'll show you the differences as we go through. So uh, first is go through the eye and then here is the first difference uh, where I recommend going through twice, go through that eye two times, that'll just strengthen the knot a little bit more. This braid is real slippery, much more slippery than mono, so I uh, highly recommend going through twice. But when you do so, always be careful that the these that second loop, that it always stays up at the top. Um, sometimes it'll try to get caught down at the very bottom, so always make sure that, that they're both on the top. So keep pressure on them. Uh, this is how it should look. Um, once you're done with that, with your left hand, basically pinch down on this opening, on the opening of the two lines. Because what we're going to do is we're going to wrap around the main line, and then at the end we're going to we need to go through that loop. So we need to keep we need to keep this loop uh, open. So we're going to go through the line and the typical improved knot. I'm sorry, improve, improved clinch knot says to go around five times, we're gonna double that. So we're gonna go around it 10 times. I think that's five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. And so now again, as I said, we're gonna go through that first loop that we created. So this loop way over here on the, on the left, we're gonna go down and uh, we're gonna go from behind and through it. Make sure I got it through. Hopefully the camera can see that, but yeah, I just went through that knot. And let me pinch down on that so we can uh, see what we just did. So went through the knot, I'm gonna clear it out a little bit. So we, again, we went, we went from the top through that knot and then we just, in doing so, we made this second loop. So you now see this big loop right here. So with the tag in, we're gonna go through that big loop. Now, excellent. So what we did again, we went through the first loop and you can kind of see it here. And then we, in that loop that we just created, we went through that one. So now you can pull it tight. And uh, in doing so, t uh, pull up on the tag end slowly, just to make sure that it's all nice and, uh, and, and comes down f um, in, a, in a nice form. On the, all these little loops here, you wanna make sure that they're always going in the same direction, that they're not basically looping over each other. Um, so again, you can kinda see it as I pull down, I'm, I'm putting some tension on the tag end and pulling down. So we have it now uh, nice and small. We'll go ahead and pull it out a little bit just to make sure there's no overlap. At this point, I'm going to put some uh, some uh, saliva on it. You can either dip it in the water or, uh, or or lick it. So let's put it in my mouth real quick. And uh, so now it's time to start putting down some more tension. So we're going to let it go down. It's basically a slip knot right now, and we're going to put a little more pressure on it with the tag in. And now that it's there with a, some good amount of pressure, I'm just going to uh, pull on the main line and just solidify the knot. And there you are, it's a nice, uh, just a nice looking uh, small knot. It's called, the, again, the improved clinch knot. And this is, again, the 10, 10 turns with doubled up through the hook. So now it's as simple as uh, clipping off the tag end. And that's it, that is the knot. And uh, what we're doing now is we're, was we're testing all the, the most popular knots. And so this is one of the, the I guess, the competitors. We're just doing head-to-head -head, uh, test in this, uh, in this example. So to see the results, you can go to saltstrong.com. You'll see an area there with the strongest knots. So uh, check it out, and uh, we hope you, uh, hope you enjoy. If you have any questions, uh, feel free to leave uh, any, any questions or comments in the little comments area below. We uh, check those frequently. Uh, anyhow, uh, wish you the best, and go out there and catch some big ones.